this is Sound Out here with part three of Ebi Origami slash Daikai O. Um, I covered Daikai O, Ebi Origami, Daikai O, uh, most of them in part one. Uh, covered the transformation of Ika Daikai O and Daikai Shinkano, and now I am bringing you part three Daikai Shinkano and the Ika Tenku Buster. Alright, um, it said to go into part three because I could not cover this in two minutes. This is, <coughs> excuse me, um, this is an awesome combination, as you can see. Very nice. The instructions and the show say to point those down, but I like them up. It looks cool. Um, as you can see, barely any of Shinkano can be seen. Straight on, just the legs there. Um, which is kind of cool. Uh... Articulation, you know, I got the same arm articulation as Daikaio. Um, head doesn't move. There's a ball joint on the face, so if you wanted to move his face, you could. Um, two joints here, so they can rotate here and here, and they can bend inward, which is creepy. Um, he again has the knees and the ankles, but you're really limited because of so much stuff. Um, so, I, I best pose I can get him into is this kind of, um, Pose here. Now, you could, if you wanted to, use Shinkano's sh sword and shield with this combo. Personally, I don't like it, um, because it seems, doesn't seem right. Um, but normally in the show, you just use, uh, the nor South Daikaio's, uh, swords here. Um, let me just clip them in here. Yes, there's a lot of balance issues with him due to all the stuff on him. I mean... Come on, that's a lot of pieces. If you watch part two, you you know this is a lot of pieces. All right, so there you go. Um, and I think I forgot to mention this twice, but I got this from uh, CS Toys International. They were formerly at CSToys-Store.com. They are now moving to CSToysJapan.com and using yen prices, which is something I'm not agreeing with too much. Um, because U.S. prices are easier to keep track of. So, there we go. Uh, best pose I can get him into. It looks just good standing there. I mean, it's just like, just like Serpentera. Um, I don't know the Japanese name of him, but Serpentera from Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. Um, you know? It's just impressive standing there. You don't need any articulation. It's impressive standing there. Um, now, the deluxe version, on the other hand, um, uh, is again a little bit blockier. Um, I actually like... I like that guy Shinkano like this. He's, he's nice and impressive. The deluxe version just doesn't do it for me. Um, as promised, I will do the Ike Tenku Buster review in this review. Um, here's the Ike Tenku Buster. Um, as you can see, it's kind of like a gun. Um, in the show, sort of move up and down, hard with spin. This part would, uh, have fun. Um, these parts would spin and it shoot a giant Moji Car Blast and blow up half the city. Oh, wait, it wouldn't blow up the city, it only hurts Kendoshu. That's what they say. Now, as you can see, Daikai Sh That was weird. As you can see, Daikai Shinkano can use. The Ikatunku Buster as a giant cannon! Yay! Okay, this guy is definitely joining Team Hilarious Overkill. That's just insane. Um, and, and you see me, there's no pics of Samurai Hot O yet. Yeah. Um, overall, the Shinkano, Daitunku, Ika Daikao, um, series, they're all great. If you can't afford the deluxe ones, just go for these. CS Toys has them, they're switching to yen prices, which gets confusing, but... You know, CSToysJapan.com, go check there. If you don't like those prices, you want to order cases from Hobby Link Japan, it's up to you. All I know is that these are really cool, and I'm glad to get them, and I hope they get Kaiori Origami soon. If I get that, I'll be all caught up. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, but yeah, so for the most part, 
Thank you for pretty much the review of these guys here, you know? These two. Uh, scratch that, these guys. <laughs>